he hurts a lot. Oh wow, they're coming for me too. Locks. What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. We are still playing Valheim and today I want to show you guys a few things. Some things that I forgot to show you. Other things are uh, the new stuff that we unlocked uh, by beating the boss just now. So I'm going to get everything built and then we'll come back and, and uh, show you guys all the stuff that that we were able to um, that we were able to make all the stuff that we unlocked so i'm gonna get to grinding and i'll be right back with you guys hey guys welcome back i just wanted to um interrupt my farming a little bit because we uh I, I put the furnace here the big furnace what's it called uh hold on it's called the, the blast furnace so i put it down and we began to uh, to melt some of the black metal that we got and i just wanted to do this with you guys and there it is black metal shield all kinds of back uh, pots and pans it is a cauldron upgrade very very nice um, i also noticed that we also unlocked the stone oven so i'm gonna go ahead and try to build as much of the stuff as i can and uh, show you guys once i have crafted what they do and, and whatnot i just made this stuff for the for the windmill so we're gonna pop it down right now and oh it didn't unlock anything like it usually does i put stuff here and then stuff come out here so whatever it is that we use this for i'm gonna find out i have no idea but um it's done it's made we'll move on to the next one and here we go spinning wheel now i'm gonna pop it right next to the windmill i'm assuming they're related and uh oh it requires a roof okay maybe i can put it right here so add the flex here i'm assuming it comes out here sounds good now to put the oven the, the stone oven somewhere uh I, i'm gonna probably redo this whole area i started actually building back here a little bit to uh, add more space because obviously we're gonna need it um so this is gonna be all different next time you guys see it probably but let's pop it in here and see if it unlocks anything it does not so it says i have to i can bake an item and i need to add wood to it okay so i'm not quite sure what this is about either the whole baking thing uh but my guess is that uh, it's gonna have make more sense once i make this actually five metal i think i have five black uh black metal already let me see i do i have exactly five all right cool so with that in mind i guess we'll do this as well the pots and pans i just need some iron copper and fine wood can i find a little place to squeeze it i'm gonna change this whole thing but okay so this works so my guess is that once i put this down it's gonna unlock some things that i can use the uh the, the stone oven for Oh, that was anticlimactic. That didn't unlock anything for me. Oh, cardium level four. There you go. I needed to get closer. But that didn't give me anything, did it? Wolf score. Hmm, interesting. There it is. All the new stuff is pretty much here in the base. It's kind of a mess. I have to fix everything. I have no idea what to do with this oven. I have no idea what to do with these uh so we'll i guess we'll figure it out as we um as we grind and uh i'm gonna go finish all the stuff up and uh i guess i'll see you guys uh later welcome back again hello i'm back i for almost forgot to come in here and add the new trophy uh so i think this is the one right now this one is interesting because you always have the wind behind you when you're sailing I'm going to activate this power for now. That way, if I ever want to go sailing and I ever want to go, uh, you know, just uh, just exploring and stuff, I can just always have the wind in my favor. That's, that's actually very helpful. But is that something that I have to use? Let me see. Oh, it is. So I use it and it lasts five minutes. Mm, that's actually not that great. 
Only five minutes? No, I'm gonna go back to my old one. <laughs> Never mind. Change my mind. Here is the stuff I wanted to show you guys. I kind of forgot about it. So we made some uh, Fenrir stuff. And um, I wanted to show you guys the difference between speed. Uh, so like, watch, I'm going to run over to this thing. Look, look how fast I'm running with the current gear that I have on right now. Right? So you can kind of get a feeling. So like if I'm here and I want to run to the other side. One, two, three four five six seven eight roughly eight seconds to run across this wall now if i put this stuff on not only do you look badass i mean holy crap man look like real real badass right not only do you look badass but look how fast you can breath across the stain now one two three four about half the time so you are so much faster and look at this you can just dodge everything run around dodge like this thing is fast look at the pig trying to get to us just can't you just can't do it i reckon that you can even run towards that deer and literally sneak up on it with speed let's try Let's see. Oh, yeah. See, it saw me, but it was too late. That's crazy. <laughs> That's really funny. This Fenrir stuff is really fun to play with. It doesn't give you a lot of armor. Like, I have 40 armor. Uh, and the, the Flash Rippers, you know, it's okay. It does okay damage. Obviously, if I have my full gear on, uh, I, I'm a lot sturdier, right? 82 armor. Like, it's so much better. But... You know, it's a fun thing to do if that's your thing. So I wanted to show you guys what that was like. All right. Now that everything has been farmed and everything has been built, it is time to have some fun. So we're going to take off and kind of go around here on the west coast of the plains and see if we can find anything that's worthwhile as far as raiding villages from the goblins or, or finding some more materials or whatever it is so let, let's just see where this adventure takes us this time hey locks don't get angry i'm just i just want berries that's all you're getting you're gonna get angry aren't you why are you why are you following me Fire? stop following yeah, me follow, this one's following me too stop following me dude right because <laughs> you're just gonna aggro on me i'm just gonna run and hopefully you to stop following me it's really I mean, it makes it easy to tame them, that's for sure. Can't wait to tame one of these. You're just going to follow me into a trap. That looks like a big village, too. Watch out for the death mosquitoes, because they are very dangerous. Oh, there's a lot of goblins there, guys, so... I'm going to try to hit one from a distance. I just met. Oh, you didn't miss. Oh, that's a two star goblin. Be very careful with it. Okay. Oh, Edward died. How did you die? Oh. He hit through my block. I didn't stagger him, and then I got hit by uh, another goblin that was... Oh, the one that's throwing the... And he's throwing the spears. Yep. Alright, I killed him. Be very careful with that two-star, babe. Oh! Run! Oh my god, yeah, don't even try to block the two star. He is so strong. We need uh we need black um black metal shields for this guy. Oh they burned me. I literally have four health left, so I cannot I need to go back. Retreat! Retreat! 
I don't have, uh, I don't think I have the mead. No, I don't. So I can't heal myself. Stop, I have one. Hold on, hold on. There we go. Oh, he ran back. I just gave you one. You. I just gave you one, a mead. Okay, thank you. All right, nice. Yeah, I see the mages. Not sure how to kill the mages. Yeah, hitting them doesn't really do anything. So I'm not quite sure how we're supposed to kill them. Because they have this... Prote oh, I broke the protection. You can break the protection that they have. Very nice. I killed one. All right, cool. Oh, I got a uh, selling trophy or something. Very good, babe. Good job. There you go. He's dead. Let's go see if we can kill that two star. The two star is the danger. Oh, it's not the same guy. Be very careful. There's a two star. There you go. Yeah, make them swing and attack. Don't don't block them. No, oh, where you going, bro? Come here. Oh, he almost swung at me. Careful, he could probably kill you with that kind of health if he swings at you. Yeah, <laughs> for you too. Come here. Aha! That's the one with the with the torch. Nice. Oh, there's a lot more coming. Oh, ouch. Oh, this one is dangerous. He throws spears. Dead. If we can get rid of the one star, then it'll be a little easier. Good job. He hurts a lot. Oh, wow. They're coming for me, too. Locks. Oh, man. If this locks hits this building, it'll all come crashing down. Oh. This guy almost threw a spear at me, dude. There's spear throw. I'm oh. dead, help me. Oh, crap. I'm dead. This locks is not making things very easy. I'm going to try to move the locks out of the way. Where did you die? Oh, you went all the way up the mountain, huh? I died because there was a locks chasing me and a mosquito. I've got all of them chasing me right now. Edward, where are you? Ow, the locks hurt so much. I just want to kill the goblins. That's it. I don't want to kill you. Oh, that death mosquito. I'm dead. Oh, ho, ho, ho. that was 200 damage in one shot. He's right behind you, too. Oh, yeah, yeah. Said it. <laughs> I was like, it's right behind it. I didn't realize you were that close. Try to get the two star, babe. If you're gonna shoot them, this guy right here. Yeah. Oh. Nice. He's losing health over time. There it is. 
God bless poison arrows. We all found barley. There is like black metal everywhere here. I can't hit the guy at the top. He's a one star throwing spears. Don't worry. He's going to go down in a second. It's coming down. Is it a slow process? Apparently, yeah. I think it, it hurts it over time and it starts coming down. Don't worry, dude. You won't be safe there for long. We broke your foundations, but gravity takes time, I suppose. Yeah, yeah. Keep throwing them spears. Keep throwing them spears. Go ahead. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, not, what now? Oh, how about that? Yeah, suck it, nerd. Oh, mosquito. No arrows left. That's fine. I can block them. Come here, oh. mosquito. Oh, I'm getting some serious lag. There's another trophy there. This is what we need for the next boss. All flex everywhere. We can pick up for uh, whatever it is that we need it for. All right. Well, I guess we can go back just uh, for the sake of unloading, I suppose. Yeah, I think we have enough black metal to make the shield for us. All right. So we're back at base and I got some flax. I'm assuming the flax goes in a spinning wheel. Yeah, it does. So I've got 24. I'm going to pop them out in here and see what comes out, I guess, in a bit. Let's see, we have a whole bunch of uh, coal here. So let's go ahead and feed the furnace. Furnace has 10 black metal in there being cooked. And I'll put the rest of the black metal here. Wow, well, yeah, we already have 24 just that I brought in plus the 10 I put in there. Now the barley, barley wine, fire resistance. Okay. Oh, linen. Oh crap. That's all the, the stuff that we need. Okay. All the black metal stuff. Oh yeah. These are 26 armor at tier one, but it doesn't require black metal though. Iron and the linen. That's the porcupine. Yeah, that looks nice. I still don't know what to do with this barley. Oh, I can put it here in the mill, can't I? Yeah, you add the barley to the mill. Is there any? No, it just does it by itself. It doesn't need any uh, fuel or anything. Anyways, guys, this is going to be it for today. It's going to this episode was a little bit different. There wasn't anything major that we did, but I was able to craft all the stuff, figure out some of the things that we need to do. Uh, so we're going to get to grinding. We're going to get prepared and um, hopefully the next episode might be uh, might be either our lock taming or it'll be uh the boss so i'm gonna go do our thing and i'll catch you guys on the next one and and again if you guys don't mind hitting that like button and the subscribe if you haven't so already later